Now, farm to table, 1998, 1999, that was ahead of the curve. It was way ahead of the curve. Serving organic food in a mainstream restaurant, that was ahead of the curve. Gluten-free, I've known since 1999 that there's a serious problem with people having a gluten-free allergy. Long before celiac disease tests were getting put out there, long before allergy tests were pinpointing, I knew there was a problem. I was studying holistic nutrition. I was reading book after book after book because it was my passion. And I knew there was a problem. So back then, I just said, you know what? If I don't have to put gluten in my food, it's not, it's not getting gluten. I want to buy tamari, gluten-free tamari. I want to buy a gluten, have a gluten-free bread option. I'm a gluten-free burger bun option. I'm going to have whatever's gluten-free options. Our brownies, gluten-free. A bunch of our desserts, just gluten-free right, right out of the gate. Because I knew that that was coming up. I could forecast and say, hey, this is what I believe in. But if I would have abandoned myself after four years or five years, because the gluten-free craze has still not hit on by 2004, 2005, 2006. Now, a good percentage of our customers are gluten-free. And they come to us because we have gluten-free and because I know what I'm doing with gluten-free.